Welcome to Lenox Hill Neurosurgery. I am Dr. Jafel Cerulli, a neurointerventional surgeon in the Department of Neurosurgery at Lenox Hill Hospital. I specialize in the endovascular treatment of vascular pathologies of the head, neck, and spine. In this video, I will give you some information about the diagnosis and treatment of a stroke. Over 800,000 people in the U.S. suffer a stroke every year, and a stroke is the number one cause of adult disability. The most common type of a stroke is an ischemic stroke, where a clot blocks the blood flow to the brain. It is important to recognize the symptoms of a stroke. We typically use the acronym FAST. Look for face drooping, arm weakness, speech difficulty, and T, time to call 911. When there is a major artery blocked, about 2 million neurons die every minute. Therefore, once the patient is having a stroke, the most important thing is to give the patient the right treatment as quickly as possible. This can make a big difference in someone's life. This can determine whether a person can spend the rest of their life in their, with their loved ones, leading a normal, productive life, versus spending the rest of their life wheelchair-bound in a nursing home. Fortunately, we have effective treatments for a stroke. We can give a clot-busting medication intravenously, which typically works well for small clots. For bigger clots, including larger vessels, we can perform a minimally invasive procedure called mechanical thrombectomy or clot retrieval, in which, through a small incision in the patient's leg or arm, we can navigate a catheter into the occluded artery in the brain and take the clot out, which then restores the blood flow into the affected area of the brain. Again, the quicker we do this, the better the outcome. Effective acute treatment requires a multidisciplinary team, and here at Lenox Hill Hospital, I am very proud to be part of a phenomenal group of specialists who are very passionate about a stroke care.